Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, explain cucumber hooks. Let me answer. Using cucumber hooks, we can run the setup code or tear down code. Okay? Cucumber hooks are nothing but the methods which can be used for running the setup code or tear down code. Before running any scenarios in the feature files of the Cucumber, if you want to run some setup code, then that is possible by running this Cucumber hook method. Similarly, if you want to run some tear down code, that is closure code, after every scenario of the feature files in Cucumber, then we can use the same Cucumber hook methods. So there are different type of cucumber hook methods that is uh, which can be annotated with at the rate before, at the rate after, at the rate before step, at the rate after step. So the cucumber hook which is mentioned with uh, at the rate before annotation, okay, that is before hook method will be running before every scenario in every feature file, okay. Whereas after hook method will be running after every scenario in every feature file. Whereas before step hook method will run before every step in every scenario of every feature file. After step hook method will run after every step of every scenario of every feature file. So let me practically show you where exactly we create these hooks in the Cucumber projects and how does they look like. So here is the project we have. Here we have the feature files. You can see these are the feature files. And these feature files are implemented in the step definition files under the step definitions package. Similarly, we have something like hooks package. Under that, we created these hooks. And uh, if you go to this hooks class, you can see some methods. Like uh, this is one method, this is another method. For example, this method is annotated with which hook before hook. So it will contain the setup code, the code which you need to run before running any scenario in any feature file. Okay. So here we are opening the application URL, such kind of uh, before hook method this is. And this will be running before every scenario in every feature file. This before hook method will run, for example, if you go to this uh, uh, register, let's say, okay, before this scenario is run, this before hook method will be running. The code inside the before hook method will be running before this scenario. Not only this scenario, even before this scenario also, this before hook method will be running. Before this scenario also, this particular before hook method will be running. Before every scenario in every feature file, this before hook method code will be running. Similarly, after every scenario, after every scenario in every feature file, after hook method will be running, that is closing the browser, taking the screenshot and all those stuff. Okay, if that particular scenario fails, then we are taking the screenshot. Then we'll closing the browser. Okay, this code will be running after every scenario in the feature file. Similarly, in this hooks class, we can create few more hook methods, which can be annotated with at the rate before step, at the rate after step. They can be running before every step, before this step, before step uh, hook, uh, hook method will be running. After this step, after step hook method will be running. Before step, before step hook will be running. After this step, after step hook method will be running. So hope guys you understood what exactly are Cumber hooks. They are meant to run some setup or tear down code either before a scenario or after a scenario or before a step or after a step. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.